Hi everybody, it's Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak. Today we're going to look at um, hip pain, groin pain, with lumbar rotation to the left. We're going to try to differentiate, is it lumbar pain or hip pain? So when you tell the patient to go into the position, we're going to have Donis take his right leg and bring it across his left. That will bring us into internal rotation on the hip as well as spine rotation to the left. In that position, he has groin pain. We don't know where it's coming from, lumbar spine or hip. So we're going to try to differentiate. So Donis is going to come over here. You're going to take your, go across, good. You're going to put your hands on my shoulder. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take his pelvis and I'm going to rotate it all the way to its end range of internal rotation. Okay, that's going to bring his pain on. Then you're going to bring your hands to the opposite shoulder. And now what we're doing is we're taking the spine and we're moving into right rotation. If the pain goes away, then we know the lumbar was the one that was involved in this pain, the left groin pain. Come back. And that's it. So the key is you take the motion, have them go through the full range of motion. Then you're going to take the lumbar rotation off by going to the right. Again, if we still had pain, it would be the groin. If it went away, it was the lumbar spine. Kind of a quick way in the clinic to differentiate hip pain versus lumbar pain. Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak.